Here we are in the fascinating and immense area control center at Rome's Ciampino Airport, the biggest and most technology advanced in Europe. It is from here that the center's personnel assigns each aircraft in flight its altitude, flight levels, velocity, and routes foreseen by its flight plan, as well as explain necessary maneuvers in order to approach the airport of destination. The center at Ciampino is one of ENAF's four Italian control centers. The others are in Brindisi, Milano, and Padova, and together they manage the entire Italian airspace. It is thanks to these vanguard structures and to these air traffic controllers that ENAV is able to ensure that the two million aircraft which cross our skies every year can do so safely and regularly. This is done by following procedures set and shared by the international community in order to coordinate the routes of numerous planes that fly through the so-called highways of the skies. For a long time, ENAV has been involved in studies and research was aimed to determine new flight routes which reduce both mileage and flight time. Such shorter routes would mean not only a saving in fuel, but also a reduction in carbon emissions into the atmosphere. Its goal to optimize air traffic as well as safety, which is at the heart of ENAV's missions, has resulted in investments amounting to 1,350 million euros, entirely financed by ENAV itself. Such investments have brought the company to be recognized by Eurocontrol as a leader among international service providers, especially thanks to the quality of ENAV services and the accuracy of its performance. But let's get back to our airplane here, in the control center, the radar controller must manage what is called the cruise phase of AP2704. This part of the flight in which every airplane must absolutely maintain a safe distance from others is called separation. To better understand how this separation among airplanes comes about, we must imagine that a three-dimensional protection area is created around the airplane. The dimensions of this area are set by international standards. This procedure is enacted with the aid of radar systems that allow the aircraft's position to be determined with maximum precision. For this reason, ENAV oversees technologically advanced system of over 50 primary and secondary radar located throughout the nation, which guarantee the surveillance of aircraft flying near towers, airport areas and runways. The full ability of these sophisticated systems to operate is ensured by a monitoring and maintenance system. This is carried out by ENAV through its own company, TechnoSky, which boasts a record of excellence in radar management. But there is more to it than this. Each year, in fact, ENAV's flight inspection service, aircraft fleet guarantees by means of nearly 2,000 hours of flight time, a conformity to international regulations which regard radio equipment that allows pilots to orient themselves in the airspace and land by reading instruments on board. But here is our airplane close to its destination, Milan Malpensa Airport. Let's go and see how the approach phase is proceeding. Our flight is arriving. Let's see what is going to happen. As the plane is nearing its destination, the Aerial Control Center hands over the task of assisting the plane to the control tower in Milan Malpensa for the final approach. 2704 Malpensa Tower, buongiorno. Continue approach 3 left, QNH 1019, your number one. Report 4 miles on final. 
Here, as we can see, our tower controller takes over the responsibility for the plane and authorizes landing after having verified the ground traffic will allow it to do so safely. As soon as the landing gear hits the runway, the ground controller takes over and guides the pilot to the apron or parking area. Head on to 70 float, buongiorno, whiskey, Sierra, stand 511. Flight AP 2704 has reached its destination thanks to the commitments and professional skill demonstrated by ANAV air traffic controller. Their dedication to the job allowed this flight to safely cross the Italian skies along with thousands of other aircraft. Now we understand how delicate and difficult the task of these guardians of the skies is, and that advanced professional skills, which are constantly being updated, are required. For this reason, every year, ENAB organizes thousands of hours of training sessions at its Forlì Academy, which is renowned for its training excellence, where Italian, as well as many foreign air traffic controllers study and get their diplomas. As you have seen, men and women of ENAV guarantee air traffic control as well as other necessary flight services. They make sure flights are punctual and safe to and from Italian civil airports, 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. And so, now we can rest assured that our skies are safe and in good hands.